Now at five, it's not the elk, but rattlesnakes that have researchers worried in Jefferson County. Would you believe this? They're actually able to track them in hopes of keeping them out of the path of people. Researchers are focusing their work on North Table Mountain near Golden because that is prime rattler habitat surrounded by homes and businesses. CBS 4's Jennifer Bryce reporting from Jeff tonight. Jennifer, an interesting research. Yeah, and it's actually a really cool program when you look into it. Now, I want to mention that rattlesnake encounters typically happen along these trails from early spring to early fall. But the folks here in Jefferson County hope to learn more about rattlesnakes so you can stay safe. If you hit the trails at North Table Mountain, you may spot a few snake researchers roaming around with you. The folks at Adaptive Environmental Services are partnering with Jefferson County Open Spaces to study rattlesnakes. The goal of the research? When visitors use North Table Mountain or any other open space on the Front Range, that they are aware of what is good rattlesnake safety for themselves as well as their dogs. Joseph Ehrenberger and his partner Brent Schultz will do that by catching 20 rattlesnakes. Then these small transmitters are surgically implanted into the body of the snake. So far, 13 reptiles have the microchips. We go out three days a week and we follow the animals around to see where they're going when they're leaving hibernation spots in the spring, when they're going back in the fall. The goal of the $10,000 research grant is to learn behaviors of the prairie rattlesnake so trail goers can use that information to be more safe. The study will last through August. We will uh, surgically remove the transmitters that we put in this year, and then we'll let them go on and be snakes again. Just let them live their snaky little lives. <laughs> a few tips when you're out here on the trails. If you see a rattlesnake, I'm told just go in the other direction. Don't stomp. Don't make a lot of noises. That actually makes them more aggressive. And take your headphones out. I know that we are so tempted to be on our phones and listening to music when we have this gorgeous country behind us and to be in it, but um, that really can hinder you sometimes hearing the sounds around you. And also, if you can, hike in pairs. So if something does happen, you do get bit by a rattlesnake, you have that help there to back you up and certain if you get bit, go to the hospital immediately. Your keys and your phone are your best friend in that situation. Live in Golden, Jennifer Bryce, CBS 4 News. All right, Jen, thank you.